everyone, this is Shannon at the Germantown Public Library and I'm going to tell you about our project that we will be doing for Take Home Crafts this week and it is a string art pumpkin. You will need the supplies that you have picked up from the library in your bag. You will also need a few things from around the house. You'll need a roll of tape, a pair of scissors, a hole punch, a pencil, and if you have it, a glue gun or some other kind of glue. First thing you're gonna do is you will take your hole punch and you're gonna punch holes all the way around the outside perimeter of your plate. Those are the holes that you're gonna string the yarn through so you can make them as close or as far apart as you want. Just know the more holes that you have, the more yarn you're gonna be able to get across your plate and the more filled in your project will be. After you've punched your holes, you're gonna take your, your yarn and you're gonna cut a length of it off. You're gonna take a piece of tape and you're gonna wrap it around one end of the yarn. This will be the end that you will thread through the holes on your plate. So you can go ahead and pull it through. And then I would suggest going ahead and using another piece of tape to secure the other end so you don't keep pulling the yarn back through as you're working. And after that, it's kind of up to you whatever design or pattern you wanna do. You can thread the yarn through back and forth across your plate. You can go side to side, up and down, however you want. You can do a spoke pattern. I did all different directions because I wanted mine to be really filled in and I also even went around the edge. Once you have your plate covered with yarn, and it may take you several lengths adding to it before you have it exactly how you like it, but once you have it done, we're ready to add the stem and the vines. So the first thing you wanna do is take your little piece of brown paper that was included in your bag and use your scissors and you could just cut yourself whatever kind of a stem you want. Doesn't have to be anything fancy or anything specific. Here's a stem that I've cut out. So you set that aside and then you're gonna take your pipe cleaner and you'll wind it around your pencil to make your vine. And then you can go ahead and slide it off the pencil and there you have your vine. After that, it's a simple matter of just gluing the stem and the vine to the back of the plate. So you'll add a little bit of glue, stick the stem on the back, add another little bit of glue, and you'll stick your vine back there and make sure it kind of shows here behind your stem. After that, your project is complete and you should have yourself a nice string art pumpkin. These kits will be available, available for pickup on Tuesday we hope you enjoy it and we will see you next time for another fun craft.